What it do everybody in the LDBC Top of the AM It's your boy CB Shout out to the whole LDBC Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe And hit the bell notification icon at the end of this video Go subscribe to 78 Sports TV And not only that but free 78 Sports TV Second off Go subscribe to Black Fight Fan TV It's him and 78 doing a collab every morning Around 8.30 or 9 o'clock Probably like 9 o'clock um, Central Standard Time Go subscribe to the my boy TBC, the Boxing Clinic, CJ the Goodfella, the Boxing Clinic, and more. Go subscribe to all the brothers in the LDBC, Blood Boxing Returns, Ticket TV, all the brothers, etc. This video I'm about to make right here is not a boxing video. This is something very personal to me, you know what I'm saying? It's something that needs to be said. And shout out to Dante's Boxing Nation. Shout out to Town Business, JS, and Town Business All Media. Go subscribe to both of them brother channels, you know what I'm saying? That's a real, real dude right there. Real good dude. My gripe is this with WWE. I've, I've watched WWE since I was three years old, you know what I'm saying? I just recently stopped watching it because I seen what what I, what I you know what I'm saying, the writing on the wall, which is Vince McMahon has been a racist for a long time. That entire company's been a racist. I've had too many countless wrestlers like the Mark Henrys, the Rocks, you know what I'm saying? The New Day, which is Big E, Kofi Kingston, and Xavier Woods, you know what I'm saying? Titus O'Neil, brothers like that. People don't know Vince McMahon was going to fire Titus O'Neil all because he touched him if Triple H, his son-in-law, had never talked to him, whose real name is Paul Levesque. My whole thing is, and why I take this shit so motherfucking personal, they reinstated Hulk Hogan. Now, the Hulk Hogan said all those blatantly disrespectful and foul stuff about black men, just in general, because his daughter's getting, getting BBC down hard. You know what I'm saying? Hulk Hogan is, a, is the biggest fraud known one of the biggest, well, the biggest fraud in wrestling because he played it off cool all these years. He had everybody, you know what I'm saying, fooled. Like, if you grew up in my generation, the era, every kid was a Hulkamaniac, you know what I'm saying? I was, you know what I'm saying? Because we didn't know then. But yeah, Hulk Hogan's a piece of shit. He's a classless, disgustingly human being. And um, I'm glad those brothers spoke out about it, but it just go to show you what WWE values is, starting from the top on down with Vince McMahon and, you know what I'm saying, even his kids and his son-in-law, you know what I'm saying? And just the entire company is a racist company. So I'll tell any black person, don't watch WWE to hell with them. I don't watch them anymore. They're a classless piece of crap. Hulk Hogan's a, a, a piece of crap. That entire company's a piece of crap. You know what I'm saying? Any minority that works for them or do business with them, you're a piece of crap. Knowing that this is a blatant racist piece of trash. Vince McMahon ain't never like black people. He said so much, you know what I'm saying? Look, just go back and look in Vince McMahon files, stuff he said. <coughs> Excuse me. Not only that, but Vince McMahon also is cool with Donald Trump. Him and Donald Trump are best friends. Birds of a feather flock together. We all know this. This ain't nothing new up under the sun. So this needs to be said. So I'll tell everybody, do this to the WWE because they're a piece of crap and they're class and they're a racist company. They've been a racist company. And that's all my thoughts on that. I'm going to keep this video short and sweet. But, yeah, Hulk Hogan can go to hell. WWE can go to hell. I, so, I, I, I refuse to support y'all product. I refuse to support y'all, period. And this your boy, CB. Shout out to the LDBC. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. And if you want to follow me on Instagram, that's at underscore gladiator81. 88, gladiator 81. And that's also, if you will follow me on Facebook, that's just at Carl Burrell. This Carl Burrell, a.k.a. CB Sports. And I'm out.